Hey, what's up, you guys? It's your boy, Carlos Music, and I'm back with another tutorial. That's right, another tutorial. Now, in this tutorial, we'll be studying the Carpenters close to you. Just a feel-good song. I love, love, love it. Now, look, rest in peace to Karen Carpenter, and I'll do my best to interpret these chords and progressions, and if it can help anybody with this song, then I'm all for it. Let's get to it. All right, so the intro is like this. So it starts off with this G sus4. G, C, D, and this C major, E, G, C. Now each time it's passing from the chords, it's gonna pass with this G, right? So. Right? So each time you pass with that G, right? So let's get into the verse and then I'll break down what's going on, right? So. Why do birds suddenly appear every time you are near? Just like me, they Stars fall down from the sky Every time you walk by Just like me They long to be close to you Right? And from there I go into the change But let's figure out what's going on here So... We have the C major, right? C in the bass, E in the right hand, a G, C. So, going to this B minor, B in the bass, F sharp in the right hand, B, D. Every time. This is when you switch from the B minor to the B minor seven. Same chord, but just move this B to an A. So, B in the bass, F sharp, A, and D in the right hand. You are near. And then it'll switch to the E minor, straight E minor, E in the bass, G in the right hand, B, E. Right? Just like me. Right? It's gonna be that uh, same C major, but we're doing this just like me. Now, once I grow up and grab this D, it's adding the ninth. They love to be. Then we'll go to our G major. Uh, G in the bass, G in the right hand, B, D, right? So, just like me, they long to be close to you. So that G major, G in the bass, G in the right hand, B, D, to a G major 7, uh, B, D, F sharp, just adding the F sharp back here. Now you'll notice when the band kicks in, the bass man and everybody else is going to start walking. Well, not walking the bass, but just moving the bass, right? So, right? So, this going the C is going to go to the G. And that uh, B is going to go to the F sharp. Right? Now, it's the bass man that's doing it, but if you're playing it on keys by yourself, it just gives it a little more flavor, right? So... You notice once I get to this last part of that um, that verse, right, that pass, I'll walk it. You notice I won't go to the G on that last pass because I know I'm coming here, right? And I want my chord to change. I don't want to be in that G in the bass already and then go to a chord because it just doesn't make it sound like it's changing chords, right? So... G 
major, G major seven. Now this chord is going to be our F6 with the G in the bass. G in the bass, A in the right hand, D, F. And that transitions us into the change, right? So. On the day that you were born, the angels got together and decided to create a dream come true. So they sprinkled on dust in the air. So that change, right? So when we come from there, it's going to go back to our C major, right? Different inversion, C in the bass, G in the right hand, C, E. Now you notice we'll be doing this vocally and also you can do it on the keys, right? So you're going to have that C major real slow. So just making sure you have this, move that G to the A, then we'll do our E minor with the G in the bass, G in the bass, G in the right hand, B, E. So. We're going to our B minor 7, B in the bass, F sharp in the right hand, A, D. So our D6 with the E in the bass, E in the bass, B in the right hand, D, F sharp. And then we we'll go to this E major, E in the bass, B in the right hand, E, A flat. Our D major, D in the bass, A in the right hand, D, F sharp. And then we'll come up here, grab that octave, just a few octaves up, and then this, right? Now that's gonna be the same D major, but we're just running it down. A, F sharp, E, D. And then we'll go right back into our verse. <laughs> step modulation right there right so it's not going to be a vocal part just yet it's going to be that uh horn solo right so the horn leads it in right <laughs> right and then we're going to go to our modulation the verse chords but we're going to be doing that horn solo verse chords right and it's gonna go into the change from there but let's just get make sure we get those verse chords and everything a half step up right so it's our D flat at the ninth right so D flat in the bass F in the right hand A flat E flat so, right and we're switching those bass notes again C sharp A flat or D flat A flat whatever you want to call it so then we have our C minor, C in the bass, G in the right hand, C, E flat, right? And we'll change that C to the G, right? On the bass notes. Change it to a C minor 7. So we're just taking that C and moving it to the B flat and makes it a C minor 7. C in the bass, G in the right hand, B flat, E flat. So from the beginning. So that's going to be our 
F minor 7, F in the bass, C in the right hand, E flat, A flat. Go to that E flat um, major chord with the F still in the bass. B flat, E flat, G. So to that F minor, right? So F in the bass, A flat in the right hand, C, F. Now you can add that E flat right to make it a seven, but I just keep it straight, so. Right? And then we go back. Now you notice, like, I'll switch it, A flat in the bass, then I'll stay here. Because I want my change to be effective right here, this A flat major. A flat in the bass, A flat in the right hand, C, E flat. E flat, right? In that right hand, but what it'll actually be called is a A flat major 7 sus 2, right? So A flat in the bass, B flat in the right hand, E flat, G. So. And then you'll do this. Right? So it's just two chords that is hidden all the way down. Just two chords, but you're changing the inversions to uh, make that top line. The top line makes it seem like it's changing chords, right? So all in the A flat in the bass. So A flat major right here. Uh, e flat, A flat, C. Now you got the E flat chord, E flat, G, B flat, back to the A flat major, C, E flat, A flat, right? To that E flat major. So like I said, two chords, right? And you just go back up and then bop, bop, two chords, right? And then we go through da 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 da, right? So let's let's try that part. So So that same thing, just a half step. Da, 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 da. So C minor. E flat in the bass, B flat, E flat, G. And then you go back to the verse, right? There's that move. Go back. intro, right, intro uh, sequence, but half step up, right, and invert it a little bit. Right, so that, that's going to be our E flat sus 4, E flat in the right hand, A flat, B flat, A flat major chord, C, E flat, A flat, so... you're passing with this E flat from chord to chord, right? So, right? So, just grabbing that C, right? And 
that's that. And then once they come back, it's going to be... on one of them but that's the outro right and it'll stop for a good maybe five seconds and then they'll come right back in and that's the entire song people look i hope this helps you and if it helps you want you like the video share the video comment on the video subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit the bell here look it's carlos music and i'm out